Florida summers are all about having fun in the sun, but Lee Health Injury Prevention Resource Coordinator Sydney Boltman says it can be a dangerous time for our teens. When school stops until when school starts, those are the 100 deadliest days for teens driving. There are a couple of reasons why. They're out of school, they're in a hurry, they're doing stuff with their friends, so they're on the road a lot more, they've got more kids in the car, they become more distracted, they have a tendency then when they're distracted to not see the stop sign and stop better. Many times, teens will be on their phone when they're behind the wheel. They think they can text and drive at the same time, but they're inexperienced. Um, they're not as quick to respond to things because they're not exactly sure what they're looking at. Boltman says that kids learn their driving habits from their parents, so make sure that you're a good role model. The more you can practice with young drivers, the better. Get out there and practice with them a lot more than the 50 hours that are required. You know, take them out early morning when the sun is just coming up. Take them out when it's foggy, when it's pouring rain, when it's bright sunny out, or when the sun is starting to go down. It's also important to ensure they're getting enough sleep and buckle up every single time they drive. For Lee Health, I'm Devin Turk.